news, Montreal's Teflon Don is back in Canada. Vito Rizzuto landed at Pearson Airport after doing time in a U.S. prison in connection with a triple murder. Global's Mike Jolet has more on the homecoming of the reputed mob boss. Alan, Vito Rizzuto is back on Canadian soil, and it's believed he's holed up with family in Woodbridge until he can figure out who his friends are. Rizzuto landed last night at Pearson and was promptly escorted out of the airport by police. He was once known as the Teflon Don for his ability to avoid criminal charges. That is until 2004 when the RCMP got a treasure trove of information from a camera placed in his office and he pled guilty in the U.S. to playing a role in the murder of three reported mob captains based in New York. That put him in jail for the past six years. He's out now, a fact his rivals who took over Montreal in his absence surely know. What he has to really worry about is whether he'll be killed and, and, and how can he sweet talk? He's a smart guy, but how can he sweet talk his way out of this? I mean, he's become a major liability uh, for the mafia in Montreal. Let's put it this way. In the mafia, uh, retirement uh, is not an option and uh, uh, revenge doesn't have a statue of limitation. So uh, imagine a Pandora box. That is uh, uh, Quebec and Canada now. Anything can happen. Now, when he refers to revenge, he's talking about Rizzuto. While he was in jail, his son was gunned down in the street, his brother-in-law was kidnapped, and his father was killed by a sniper standing in his own kitchen in front of his family. Now, put it all together, and it seems like a gangster movie, but that's Vito Rizzuto's life.